members of SAGE are making huge decisions that have huge financial consequences for tens of millions of people, it would be... It, it is important that our constituents know whether or not the, pay, the people making these decisions are sharing the pain or, or insulated from the pain. For example, uh, in the case of young people, many people, many SAGE experts say that young people should, should be working from home. We know young people are now tied to their, to their small kitchen tables in their bedroom in miserable environments, the new dark satanic mills working endless hours in appalling circumstances because people with nice gardens and comfortable homes think that's what they should be doing. Yeah, yeah. There should also be far greater personal accountability. There should be no more, here is Sir Mark Walport, of SAGE, but here in a personal capacity. Yeah, yeah. Nonsense, he's there because he's a member of SAGE. And we should also have elections to SAGE. So we could see Sir Mark Walport, Professor Susan Mitchie, John Edmonds, regular talking heads in our TV studios, challenged by people with a different perspective. People like Professor Carol Sikora, Professor Paul Dolan, who is an expert on human behaviour and quality of life, Professor Ellen Townsend, who has a huge interest in the welfare of children and adolescents who are now being plagued by anxiety 